please subscribe math.com for any query, comment or email. Hello everyone. Today we are going to find the ways by which you can um, separate the real and imaginary parts of the complex number. If the complex numbers are adding together or subtracting together or they are in division form or they are multiplying with each other, then how you can uh, separate their, their complex uh, or you can separate the real and imaginary parts after applying these operations on them. Or you can also say how to express the real and imaginary parts of complex numbers in the form of a plus b iota. Since the standard form of complex numbers are as we have already seen in our previous lecture on complex numbers the standard form is a plus b iota. Okay, This is the standard form of complex numbers. If the numbers are other than this form then we have to convert them in a form that will set, that will show what is the real number and what, what is the real part and what is the imaginary part. As it is clearly shown here that this is the real part and this is the imaginary part. So we have to keep this in mind while applying operations on uh, complex number. This means while adding them or subtracting them or in case when they are dividing with each other or in the case they are multiplying with each other. So we have the cases. We will discuss the um, four types of cases. Okay. Case one is when there is an addition of two complex numbers. So case one is the addition. And then you, after addition, how you can um, uh, convert them in the standard form. Okay. Then is the case two. That is the subtraction of complex numbers. Case three is multiplication of complex numbers. And case four is that is the last one division of complex numbers. So these are the cases when you came across the complex numbers in a form that is not in the standard form as they are in under some operations of, um, and they are under some operation of addition or subtraction or multiplication or division so you have to convert that in the uh, in a form in the standard form the a form that uh, will clearly represent the real part and the imaginary part separately Okay, so let's start from the case one, how you can separate the real or imaginary part of how you uh, can express the complex numbers in the standard form if they are adding with each other. So let's um, explain this by taking an example. Uh, 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 if you are given with a uh, number like and you will be asked to add them together, what you will do, you will add them as z1 plus z2 is equals to 2 plus 4 iota plus 7 minus 2 iota. Okay, we will simplify them by removing the brackets 2 plus 4 iota plus 7 minus 2 iota. Then we will combine the like terms 2 plus 7 and plus 4 iota minus 2 iota. 2 plus, plus 4 iota minus 2 iota is 2 iota. Okay, so the form at the beginning of this question is was not the standard one. This is not the standard form. Okay. So after applying the um, operation of addition, uh, we have converted the addition of the two uh, complex numbers into a number that is in the standard form and the standard form is a plus iota, a plus iota b. This is the standard form, okay, where you are having a number this is in the form of this is the a plus this is b iota. It means that the given number is now in the standard form a plus b iota where we have this is the real part okay and this is the imaginary part okay this is this was the case one where you are going to add the two complex numbers and you, then you will convert them in a standard form so this is the standard form so uh, now we will move towards the case two that is the subtraction of the two complex numbers so this is the case two for handling this situation we will take an example where you where, where we will um, subtract the two uh, complex numbers and then convert them in the standard form so if you are given with a and you are going to subtract them as z1 minus z2 then it means you have to write this equation first minus 7 plus 2 iota now we will remove the brackets 2 plus 3 iota minus now the sign with 7 is plus you have to multiply the sign of 
7 with this minus okay so min minus will be multiplied with plus to give minus plus uh, plus is minus so we'll write minus 7 and then minus into plus with 2 iota is minus so minus 2 iota you have to multiply the signs with uh, uh, by removing the once you remove the brackets okay then we simplify them by uh, uh, collecting the like terms as 2 minus 7 plus 3 iota minus 2 iota 2 minus 7 is minus 5 and plus 3 iota minus 2 iota is plus iota so we have got a form that is exactly in the st standard form okay so according to the standard form this is the real part and this is the imaginary part so we have separated the real and imaginary part after subtraction of the two complex numbers so the standard form was a plus b iota or iota b okay so this is the, this one and this number is this one okay so uh, it was all about case 2 let's move towards the case 3 that is about the multiplication of the, of the two uh, complex numbers so we will take an example where two complex numbers are going to be multiplied as z1 is equals to minus 7 plus 3 iota this is z1 and z2 is that is the complex number 1 and minus 2 plus 4 iota is the complex number 2 and we will multiply them as z1 dot z2 is equals to minus 7 plus 3 iota and minus 2 plus 4 iota and how we will multiply them we will multiply each element of the first complex number with the second where with the with the uh, with all the elements of the second complex number how let's write it down first we take this number and we'll write as minus 7 and we'll multiply this with the this whole expression and we'll write it as minus 2 plus 4 iota then we will take what this element and we'll write as plus 3 iota and then we will multiply it with the with this in uh, this expression and write as as uh, we have already uh, seen so minus 2 plus 4 i this is how we will multiply the two uh, complex numbers it means each complex number will be multiplied with the whole second expression okay after this we will simplify them as minus 7 into minus 2 is 14 and minus minus is plus so we will write plus 14 okay then we will multiply minus 7 with 4 iota so minus 7 into 4 is minus 28 minus 28 and iota will be as it is okay then we will multiply this plus 3 iota with minus 2 so 3 2s are 6 minus as there is minus so minus plus minus and 3 2s are 6 6 iota then we will multiply this 3 iota with 4 iota then 4 3s are 12 and it's plus plus 12 and 2 iotas we will write iota squared so this is how we can simplify equation then we will combine the like terms as um, first we will simplify the iota square by minus 28 iota minus 6 iota plus 12 iota square is minus 1 okay now we can write as these are the like terms so we will combine them as 14 minus 12 and these are the like terms minus 28 iota minus 6 iota then what we will get is 14 minus 12 is 2 and minus 28 iota minus 6 iota is as they both are minus so they will add together and the sign sign will be of negative so 28 plus 6 is 34 34 iota so this is the answer of z1 dot z2 it means multiplication of the two complex numbers okay so now it is clear from here that the that this equation is in standard form standard form that is a plus b iota okay so this is the same this is exactly the same as a plus b iota this represents this one and this and this one so this is how you can convert the complex numbers when they are going to be multiplied with each other into the standard form and you can separate their uh, their uh, real and imaginary parts like this okay now we move towards the, the case 4 that is the last one and it is very important when when you are uh, uh, when you are going to divide the two uh, com complex numbers. In division of complex numbers we will 
we will came across uh, three different types of uh, equations to solve them uh, accordingly uh, for finding the real and imaginary part or to separate the real and imaginary part of the complex number let's start from the type 1 where you will came across the equation as 1 divided by 1 plus 2 iota since this equation is not in the standard form and we have to convert it into the standard form by using some method let's see how you can convert it into the standard form now 1 divided by 1 plus 2 iota can be converted by multiplying this equation with the conjugate or the complex conjugate of its denominator it means the conjugate of this you have to find the conjugate of denominator how you can find the complex conjugate for finding the complex conjugate you have to, to um, invert the sign of its complex part it means 1 plus 2 iota is equals to 1 minus 2 iota so you have to do what you have to multiply and divide this equation by the complex conjugate of the denominator like this okay after that you have to simplify it as 1 multiplied by 1 minus 2 iota is 1 minus 2 iota divided by 1 plus 2 iota and 1 minus 2 iota we will further simplify this equation as 1 minus 2 iota divided by as this the equation in the denominator is of the form as this equation is the same as a plus b into a minus b that is equal to a square minus b square so we can write this equation in a square minus b square form so we'll write 1 square minus 2 iota square 1 minus 2 iota is 1 minus 2 iota square 2 square is 4 and iota square is equals to minus 1 so here keep in your mind that iota square is equals to minus 1 you have to put the value here then we have 1 minus 2 iota divided by 1 plus 4 equals to 1 minus 2 iota divided by 5 okay this equation can be uh, written as 1 divided by 5 minus 2 iota divided by 5 now it is clear from here that the equation is in standard form this equation is exactly in standard form as a plus b iota okay so this is the a and b iota is this okay so this is the one type of equation uh, that we came across in division of complex numbers and we have to convert this uh, complex uh, this complex equation in a form where we can separate the real and the imaginary parts from each other okay one or two more forms you will discuss that, uh, that you will come across as one of the form is you will find 2 plus 3 iota over 4 minus iota like equation of this form how you can convert this form in, in the standard form for that purpose again you have to multiply and divide with the complex conjugate of the denominator you have to invert the sign of the imaginary part okay so we can further simplify it as 2 plus 3 iota into 4 plus iota divided by 4 minus iota into 4 plus iota then we will multiply them together as according to the um, according to the um, multiplication process of the com two complex numbers and in division we have the form of a plus b into a minus b so we can write as a square minus b square we can say here that this form is of the a plus b into a minus b is equal to a square minus b square okay so we can also write the denominator in the same form okay that is 4 square minus iota square it can be written further as we will simplify the equation as if we can write as we will um, combine the like terms as iota square is minus 1 so we will write 8 minus 3 and plus 2 iota plus 12 iota divided by 16 plus 1 is 17 so 8 minus 3 is 5 2 iota plus 12 iota is 14 iota divided by 17 and we can write them as 5 over 17 plus 14 over 17 iota and this equation is exactly of the form of a plus iota b b iota so this was 
all about how you can write such equation in the standard form of a plus b iota that's all about for today's lecture thank you thank you for watching if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe our channel math.com for more updates thank you